Alright all guys, some more the bike here. Yeah. Them Pringle guys are fucking pricks. Bah. Wee! A little bit slippy. Anyway, tall guys, some more the bike. Yeah. Hello there. Hello me! Hello! My love is coming on! Right, anyway. Enough of me create singing. Tall guys, smaller bike here. Hello. Oh, yeah, that didn't work. Anyway, hello everyone. Hello. Ay, 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 ay. Right. Um, I was gonna do some research tomorrow, but instead I'm staying behind at work to do an extra little, uh, little job. So. I'm just going to tell you now what um, what, I, what person I was going to do my little thing on last Friday. Now, um, I actually, my granddad. I was going to do it on him. Now we used to work down the pits um, in Bedlington. Actually, like the pits were literally there. Where these houses are here is where the pit was. It was called Pit B. Bed at the station, Pit B. There's a little Vespa. Hello. But anyway, um, And he used to work there for a few years, quite a few years. Um, now, he died before I was born, about four days before I was born. So, I never got to meet him. But I was named after him. Uh, it was my granddad, James. Now, I was supposed to be called Andrew, but when he died, I got his name and that was given to my second name, so I'm now James Andrew Forster. Mm, hello. Hello, everyone. That's my real name. Oh, my God. I'm not going to tell you everything about me, but here's my pain card, my thought card, all my numbers. No. Uh, anyway, um, it turns out one of his friends was working down there with him. We, you know, back then, everyone was friendly to each other down the pits. It one big family. Um, and there was an accident in one of the lifts, one of the cages that bring people up. Now, oh, now I'm gonna get out here. Oh, fuck. Um, and there was an accident, and his friend actually got stuck. The cable bringing up, the cable that was down the shaft got wrapped around his neck. Uh, and it ended up stopping the lift halfway up and killing him basically. Now at the time we didn't he didn't know he was dead, so my granda climbed down this mine shaft or climbed up the mine shaft, I'm not actually sure yet. I don't know if he climbed up or climbed down it. But he did one or, one or two. Um No the thing is he was only five foot five foot uh, what was it, five foot ten or five foot nine or something? He was quite short compared to me. <laughs> and the way he was climbing up and climbing down, either or, <coughs> there were spikes sticking out of the w out of the wall. Um, now, these spikes were about, I don't know, about this far out of the wall. But the thing is, they were six foot apart. Now, this means he either was jumping up six foot at a time, pulling himself up to get to the cage, or, he was letting himself down and dropping and letting go and catching the next one or like landing on the next one and catching it and that, keeping his balance. Which, as you can probably tell, is no mean feat like, I mean, how I mean, these pits were quite the way down and this cage was halfway up or halfway down, whichever way you want to look at it. Um, so he got down there, freed his friend from this cable. Unfortunately, like I say, the guy died still, but he gained a medal for doing it, which was a British Empire medal, which is a BEM. Now, they don't give these out anymore. Um, this is a picture of one here. Like I say, they don't give them out anymore. Or I don't know if they started to again, 
I'm not sure. I know the stuff for a while. Now, there's two versions of the BEM. There is the civilian, and there is the military. The military, you s can s tell the difference by the white stripe in the red ribbon. Now, your grandma was obviously given a, a civilian one. <coughs> um, and he left it to me in his will. Now, I didn't know this until last Friday. And I would rather look it up, look what happened up, try and get as much information as I can before I gain this medal. Um, it was supposed to be given to me on my 21st birthday, but my dad had a lot of it, which I don't blame him, I don't blame him, like, because I was, I was moving house at the time, and it probably would have got lost, you know what I mean? Um, it was when Jimmy's engagement, it was my 21st at the same time, and there is probably a point of it would have gone missing. Um, pardon me. And it would have gone missing. I know it would have. Now, uh, I don't even trust myself with it now, to be fair. I mean, I'm happy with where it is. I know where it is. Um, and this is in the safe, keeping on the empty. Now, like I say, I think it's an amazing thing that he did, really. Um, I don't care if no one else does, but in my eyes, he was a local hero. Which is why I wanted to do the Solar Bear Challenge challenge about him. But I couldn't find a plaque or a statue, obviously. Now, he did get an engraved clock. It was a clock with a plaque on it. Um, and it's at the working man's pub down in Benetton, where I've just been through there. Did he nod? He better have nodded. I'll be looking on me, uh, me surveillance video, mind. Um, he got a scroll of Elm, of Vellum, Elm, Vellum, off the police for doing it. Uh, he got a medal off the Queen, and he got this clock, which is all these different things were given out to different people. Uh, I think my dad got the medal to pass down. My auntie got the scroll I think no that's wrong I don't know I'm not sure about that anyway um, it was just to share a little story with you really just on my way home I thought I would share it but yeah so back then me gonna was a hero <laughs> I wish I did meet him I think I would have liked him Oh, wait. Ah, it sucks. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. No, my tinsel's coming off. I'm going too fast. My tinsel's coming off. I'm not. I'm not liking it. I'm going to go on me, but I'm me. Uh, me dad's triumph again this weekend on Saturday. Cause I'm going to meet Jamie's mom, and I can't be asked with buses, so I'm getting my dad's bike. <laughs> <laughs> Have a little fun on that. Squish me nuts up again by Jamie squishing my nut ball sacks. My ballers suckers. But yeah, that's all for now. Uh, just thought I'd share that with you. Um, I'm sorry for the lack of vlogs at the minute. I have actually done a few videos, but I haven't uploaded them because literally all it is is me driving to and from work. And I'll just, I'll cover the topics that I've covered at a different time. Um, when it's a bit later and, or, or on the weekend or, or when I'm on tomorrow, I'm going to have a bit of time. So I might cover it all up tomorrow. And uh, not tomorrow, on um, Saturday. I might just have a little talk to myself. Let's see what happens on there.